What's up guys, welcome back to another episode here on Man Made Customs. So in today's episode, we're gonna go ahead and do a little bit of bridge fishing. There's a few good bridges down here in Miami. I'm gonna take some artificial shrimps, some DOAs, uh, voodoo shrimps, pretty much anything that'll sink uh, and get to the fish. So our target species is only permit. We're just going for permit today. Uh, they should be running. We also just had a cold front pass through and uh, the permit bite usually does pick up after a cold front. So we're gonna go ahead and take advantage of that and we're gonna get straight to the video. Before we get to the content guys, Make sure you subscribe, turn your post notifications on. It helps us out tremendously. Thank you so much, guys, and let's get to the content. Oh, he had it, dude. He's right there though. I just have to let him tire out. Get the net, get the net. Keep it in the water, dude. just so you guys see right there at zero right here the tip and 21 and a half and the the permit size limit is 11 inches to the fork from 11 inches to 22 inches and he's at right at 21 and a half so that is a keeper and we're gonna take him to the car and throw him in the cooler You ran out of line. <laughs> oh my god. That's cool. Austin? Awesome. Let's try to eat him.
Look at them all spooling next to it, dude. <laughs> Those aren't jacks, dude. Yo, those are monster jacks. Alrighty guys, so Sebastian just hooked up onto this nice uh, permit. For the most part, we're just, you know, throwing artificial shrimps. That's the shrimp he's using right there. It's got hinges in the back. The more realistic, the better. I'm assuming it was definitely one of these guys that I hooked up to, that you guys saw earlier Quite in the bigger, video. Bro. Yeah, maybe it could have even been bigger. Because that thing pulled like an animal. But yeah, you can find these guys in the flats, but Sebastian was explaining to me there's a certain time of year where you could get them under these bridges. But I wouldn't say this is an all year thing. No, it's not. So not an all year thing, but sometimes it gets convenient to catch these guys. Check that out. Pretty nice one for a bridge. All right guys, so here's the second permit. We are allowed to take home. It is over slot, you're allowed to keep one over slot permit. And one slot, which is right there that we got, it's gonna be dinner. Yum yum. Catch and cook coming soon. Stay tuned. Let's go home. Alrighty guys, welcome back to another episode here on Man Made Customs. So, as you guys can tell, we caught a permit in this video. We're going to go ahead and do a, a catch and cook. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to fillet a permit. It's got a lot of meat as you can tell. It runs right above that head. All the way up here you can find meat. So we're going to go ahead and fillet this guy, show you how uh, we're going to prepare him. We're going with a lemon zest recipe. Uh, I'm trying to stay with complete seasoning, lemon and possibly lime towards the end. But uh, stay tuned guys, we're going to go ahead and show you guys how to fillet a permit. <laughs> Keep the skin because we're going to cook them on the barbecue. Probably put a layer of tin foil. We're going to go ahead and wash these guys up. The other thing is, these things are scaleless. So I don't mind leaving the skin. Alright, guys, so first thing we're going to do is go ahead and throw a little bit of lemon. Uh, we read this in a recipe that permit was good with lemon. So we're going to go ahead and let these babies soak. This one a little bit more, it's a little bit bigger. And then the other thing we're gonna use is, we're gonna keep it ba pretty basic. Uh, we're using Complete Seasoning by Badia. Badia, Complete Seasoning. Pretty good, I've had it before. Uh, I had it on fish once and it actually tastes really good. But we, we did an Everglades seasoning type uh, deal last time. But we're gonna get a little fancy today. All right. So next is ground cayenne pepper. Give it a little kick. Not too much of this, cause well, whatever. <laughs> It'd be a little, little overwhelming. Everything sit on the top. Without the tinfoil, it would just fall to the bottom. So it could kind of sit in it. That's why I like it. The only thing I forgot to do was put Pam. So it's very possible these get stuck. So let's actually rub a little bit of lime there. Lemon, sorry. Oh, slap that meat on there. Slap it. it. Slap, slap, slap. There we go. As a request per Florida Bassmaster, we're going to put a little bit more seasoning. 
Black meat for everyone. That should be good. A little bit more cayenne. All right. Should be perfect. So guys, once again, complete seasoning, lemon, and uh, cayenne. Alright guys, so got them off the grill. I'd lie to you if I said that we hadn't eaten already, so I'm just gonna eat it on camera to say how good it is because it is amazing. Really good. Yeah, I need to taste it. I haven't tasted it yet. Try it. Really, really white. Very flaky meat. Super good. All right, guys, so hope you enjoyed this catch and cook. Make sure you're subscribed, turn your post notifications on, and get ready for the new footage that's about to come. Later, guys.